Hi dear friends, this is Tarikul Islam comes again with a new episode of my continuous parenting series. You know that this is a video series where I like to discuss about different issues, different aspects related with parenting. And this is now at part 4. You know that I have discussed uh, on my part 1 about the caring of babies whose age is below 1 year. And I also discussed in part 2 about the caring of the babies aged from 1 year to 5 year. On third part, part 3, I discussed about the uh, building personality of your baby. And now in part 4, I am discussing about many techniques and tools related with schooling. So, on this part, I have started from my 31st episode and this is now 33. That means I have already discussed two episodes related with part 4, schooling of the babies. And today is the third episode on these topics. Today, I will discuss about the take care of home. For the babies, when they want to school, they start to go to school. We know that in school most of the schools in that time they, the teachers try to complete their study complete their works in the school like they give some uh, class work they give some uh, reading writing uh, homework and some uh, of reading study they completed in the class either they complete it in the class or not that doesn't matter you have to follow the uh, follow through the classes in home regularly because we know that human brain is a thing that can catch anything but cannot store anything instantly. There is a medical science that calls that uh, explains that human brain is like the cache memory of computer. So whenever anything you input on it, it catch it on the cache memory. You know that cache memory is a unstable memory which is deleted after a certain period of time. So most of the memories we memorize, we input in our brain is deleted, is being deleted after a certain period of time. It may be one hour, it may be one day, it may be one week, even one month. That's why some memories we can recall before one year or one month or one week and some memories we can't recall. You will not be able to express everything on the day, the past day or yesterday that you experienced from morning to evening. Some you may ex explain, some you have forgotten. Some words you have heard, you have forgotten. Some sights you have seen, you have forgotten. Some smells even you have uh, smelled but now forgotten. Because they are in the cache memory and deleted after a certain period of time. So, what should we do? We know that in computer there is a permanent is memory space that is called RAM ROM. When we transfer any cache memory to the permanent memory, then it is stored until we delete it manually. Like that, human brain has also some permanent memory, but there is no option that you will choose this memories will be put on the permanent memory and these memories will not be put. So what can we do? We should not any, we have not any choice, but we can increase our attention in by and efficiency how our brain system is called nerve system there are a lot of nerves that connect the brain uh, cells to each other and the, the nerve when excited then they bear some memories that is transferred to the permanent memories that's why the memories which uh, make us excited like we become so much angry we become so much happy or we become so much sorrow that memories we never forget and that is uh, stored in the permanent memory that's why the most uh, funniest moment of our life the most sorrow moment of our life we never forget about it so that is the rule how can we transfer our memories to the permanent there are some scientific methods that you have to recall it after a certain period of time. When first time you read anything, you watch anything, you hear anything, it will on the cache memory. And within 24 hours, you have to recall it. Then it will be 
50 percent fixed on your memory and after one week within one week if you again recall that memory it will almost 80 percent fixed on your memory and if you recall it twice on next six months it will be permanently fixed on your memory for a long time okay but permanent doesn't means that it will uh, stay until your death it may be forgotten uh, after one year or two years or may not be forgotten it will depend upon your brain capturing ability I will not going on that uh, discussion I am just uh, offering you try to follow the classes of your baby that have discussed today because when they will recall it they will read it again within 24 hours then it will be 50 percent fixed on their memory and it will help them to memorize to recall it when their exam time or any time that is used so try to do it every day there are some books uh, you are looking that this is bengali books for class one uh, if they die in my country and in these books there are some uh, like today the teachers has uh, read them a rhyme they have uh, memorized it on the class but when they will come home you have to ask them what uh, topics discussed in the class today on bangla Bengali uh, language they will uh, uh, say that uh, the, this rhyme has been discussed and uh, memorized us then you have to uh, uh, revise it again with your baby wow it's a nice uh, rhyme that we have recited by a playing condition by a atmosphere of motivation you have to catch them draw their attention on the read and let them make it fun when you will, uh, uh, you will say that that this is a very nice rhyme let we uh, recite it or let we play like this rhyme that you may like a create a playing a game with them with this rhyme or with this story and many other times and then they will learn by playing and when they will recall it at the home their memory will be fixed otherwise it may be eliminated it may be destroyed it may be uh, lost away from their memory and you will be then angry that why you don't recall it it's actually not their fault human being is created by this method so I hope I have scientifically di discussed today about the memorizing process and I hope you will do this on your home with your baby and it will be very helpful to increase their uh, capturing ability and as well as to develop their confidence because when they can recall it they can memorize it they are, uh, automatically their uh, capturing uh, power will be increased and they will be motivated and this will build confidence from the first age early age first class of the school so i hope you will apply it on your home for the betterment of your baby thank you very much Today I am finishing my video. Bye.